We are seeing new video of a police chase that ended in a rollover wreck on the Julia Tuttle Causeway. The suspect wanted for allegedly attacking a woman and stealing her SUV. Local 10's Rosh Lowe is joining us from Miami Beach with new details. Wild dash cam video. It looked like bumper cars on Alton Road as cops were desperately trying to stop this guy who stole a car, but that is only part of the story. He said that one of the guys has them. We are taking you inside this trooper's patrol car as the pursuit is on. It's Sunday, down Alton Road we go with the Florida Highway Patrol. Sabalas cigars say cops stole this car and he wouldn't stop. Here's more of this just released dash cam video. Let's watch it play out together. And then you can see how the suspect is stopped. The car flips over. Troopers get the suspect in custody. This Toyota belonged to Glenda DeFoss. She was carjacked by this guy with a hammer, she says. I want people at home to understand this. This car is everything to you, right? Yeah, I spent so many years working by, by myself to not throw into trying to pay the car. We shared her story Wednesday. You take care of your brother and you're trying your best and this guy comes and does this. Yeah, just because he, he, he wanted it because he's like the easy way to live for him. When I am working for pay my car for so many years, it, every every month you know and look at what he did to me i love you and i guess you are like my son no my brother like my son my mother wants you to take care of, i take care of you and i will she was with her brother martin who is deaf and disabled and that toyota was stolen so this dash cam video only part of the story beyond the pursuit the crash there's the human story of family in need a sister and a brother now left without a car and asking for the public's help. So you see there's two parts of this. There's that dash cam video and there's the pursuit and then there is that human angle of this family. That car meant everything for Glenda. If you would like to help her, please go to our website, local10.com. You'll find the GoFundMe there. On Miami Beach, I'm Rosh Lowe, Local 10 News. Rosh, thanks a lot. For